Let's talk. See this? And to screw it up in the fourth, I'm just flushing my money down the pot. Your time. Fourth? Hey, you only work that out now. Guess you're not as sharp as you what, think. What is he into football? How about you tell me who you work for? Then I decide what I tell you about Van Bruggen. Does the name Seraf Industries ring any bells? Seraf Industries? Isn't that that American company stole all the headlines a while back? You're still in business. Why wouldn't we be? Check the news. Biotech corporations seem to be failing a lot these days, especially the ones who are making enhancements. Well, Brogan's in the Alice Garden pods. Capsule 301. Places a They don't have the angel of death as an employee. Sometimes. Make sure you leave him in the same shape you find him. And if I don't? Your call. But those implants of yours might look even more special on somebody else. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Aren't you fancy? All right. Malik, you were right. Tong is helping Van Bruggen. He stashed him in the Alice Garden pods. Thought as much. A hacker who knows his way around corporate firewalls would make a valuable asset for the triads. I'm at the pods myself, Jensen. Want me to run interference? No. Don't put yourself at risk. I'm heading there now. Heading there now. If I can find my way. I, f I think I think I know what's up. I think I know what's going on. What's going on? What I need to find is that little diagonal. Yeah. <clears throat> That's what I'm talking about. Find ourselves a hacker. Jensen, I I was on my way out. What are you doing here, Malik? I told, I told you not to you come I here. This one. I know. It, I didn't do anything. Trust me. Van Bruggen's all yours. Hang on a second. Something's wrong. What is it? Why are you here? It's nothing. I mean, can't a girl have secrets? No. Not for me. Uh, what's the most dick thing I could do? She'd probably like if I teased her. Depends Let's on lecture. the secrets. I doubt the boss would appreciate his chief pilot getting into trouble, especially this far from home. I can Always about the boss with you, isn't it, Jensen? I had business to attend to. Personal business. Malik, come on. Fine, since you're so damn curious. <coughs> Years ago, I used to live here, remember? No conversation, my boss friend, here. My best friend, Evelyn. She was like a sister to me. Made living here fun. But then there was an accident. She... She's dead. I'm sorry, Malik. Wait, Jensen, let me finish. Real. Yeah, real. I thought I was okay with it, but I know. I know she didn't just die. She was killed. Murdered. Her damn scumbag boyfriend did it. I know he ah, did. Ah, it's always a scumbag boyfriend. I knew he was boyfriend. trouble right from the start, but she just wouldn't listen to me. Malik, easy. If your friend was murdered, the police would have suspected something. They would just have trust an authority, That's Malik. It's it. always worked there for me. No investigation. They said she fell down a flight of stairs like it was some kind of freak accident. But her wounds, the way she died, they don't add up. It's right here in the damn blood spatter analysis. Blood spatter? You've seen the police report? Yes. A friend left a copy of it in a pod here for me to pick up. Listen, I know it sounds crazy, but I think... I think there's been a cover-up. I just have to prove it. If I could get my hands on the autopsy report, the one that never surfaced, I know I'd get the truth. Except... Why do I suspect I'm about to get dragged into something? Look, Jensen, I'm sorry. I Why know do I suspect I'm about to get a side quest? I told quest. you it was my business and I could take care of it. It's just... 
The more I think about it, the more I realize I'm in over my head. I'm just a pilot. I'm not a damn cop. But I need to know the truth. You said you've seen the police report. Who gave it to you? An old friend who was also who gave a it for you? Evelyn's. He used to work for the Shanghai PD. According he left a copy of it along with a few other things concerning Evelyn in a pod here for me to look at. He also left some instructions on how to contact someone at Lim for the autopsy report he's convinced was intentionally buried. Why would Lim have anything to do with Evelyn's autopsy report? Well, if you haven't noticed, the Chinese government has been outsourcing branches of its public services for years. Bell Tower polices the streets, and nowadays Lim does more than just cosmetic surgery. They're often contracted for special cases like Evelyn's. And what made Evelyn's mm. case so special, you think? Her boyfriend, Lee. He was at the scene. He had Evelyn's blood on him and tested positive for alcohol and drugs in his system. With his rap sheet, it wasn't looking good for him. But his family, they're on a lot of boards with deep pockets and a lot of reach. They wouldn't suffer the embarrassment of having their son indicted on a suspected murder charge. Money talks. Why do you suspect Evelyn's boyfriend had something to do with her death? Because he was poison, right from the start. Born into money and influence, but never once assuming responsibility for anything. I don't think he's worked an honest day in his life. So he was a wealthy, big-headed asshole. If Those that was silver reason spoon enough to accuse bastards. him of murder, half the world would be in the pen. No, there's more to it. Maybe they should be. He's known for violent outbursts. Also, half the world isn't rich, Jensen. He nearly killed a kid over some stupid gambling. That's the problem. Thing. The problem is, his family made him untouchable, even to the police. And Evelyn was okay with all of this. She. Always tried to see but Jensen's probably a bootstrapper. You can tell just by looking at him. You could say that's just being naive or even stupid, but I think she was just innocent. Tell me about Evelyn. She was beautiful, carefree, loved to have a good time. I met her during I think my Rita had a crush on her. transportation and logistics from here. That's in what Shanghai. this is about. Jealousy. She was a great pilot too. Knew how to feel the currents to push the bird just so. Two better talents for reading the wind didn't translate to reading guys. How so? She was always getting into trouble with the wrong crowds. And it always had to do with some boy. She knew I didn't like him, her boyfriend at the time, Lee. It drove a wedge between us, and when we parted ways, it wasn't amicable. I understand. She was a good girl, Jensen. <coughs> she deserved better. Jensen understands about not being amicable. This autopsy report. Once you got your hands on it, what were you planning on doing next? I... I'm not sure. Like I said, I'm a pilot, not a cop. But I just... I felt I had to do something while I had the chance. Maybe once you get the report and we know what it says, we can improvise. That's what I'm best at. Malik, don't take this the wrong way, but I need some kind of incentive to justify any complications. Or totally take lives. it the wrong way. I'll see what I can do, but I can't promise anything. Well, she took that pretty well. I like Farida. She's a businessman. She knows what's up. Okay, I'll help. What do you need me to do? My lead. He works for Lim. He's just cooler than Jensen. That's for fucking has sure. to their entire database. He's willing to hand over a copy of Evelyn's autopsy report. So you want me to meet him and get the report? Is that it? Yes, but he'll only respond to a certain phrase. Death and life have their determined appointments. To which he'll reply, Mercies <laughs> and honors depend upon heaven. Christ, Malik, this is starting to sound like something out of a bad spy movie. I know. Oh, unlike the rest of the game. To protect himself. I didn't pick the damn quote. <laughs> So just play along and remember the line, okay? You'll find him inside the lobby of the Lower Hengshaw Lim Clinic. Does this guy have a name? None that I know of. But he apparently goes by the handle Anonymous X. Oh. I know, I know. Anonymous Poor Chan joke. X. Okay, anything else? Yeah, before I forget, <laughs> everything concerning Evelyn's incident, newspaper articles, the police report, Lim details, it's all inside pod 009 here in the hotel. You should read over everything if you can. Pod nine. Got it. I need to go. Contact me with any updates and thank you. I really appreciate this, Jensen. Hey, as long as you got the money coming. <laughs>